Hi and good morning. Today is the 20th of August and it's 2020. One of the most annoying things that you could ever come across is cat shit in your garden. Cats can shit anywhere in your garden and you can be annoyed. You can kind of run after the cats and that's what I was thinking about this morning when I realized that they have pooped again where I don't want them to poop. So, and I decided just to say it as it is about shitting and pooping. <laughs> so, people can behave like cats. Now, for people, we normally say we have created a place where they can take their shit, they can take their rubbish, they can take their poop, they can take their mess. But with the cats, we may not be able to do exactly that. But the people who own the cats should have cat litter. For their cats but the cats wouldn't stop necessarily a hundred percent from pooping in the wild because that's how they are now there are some people who behave like cats in life however much you train them to poop where they're supposed to poop they take their poop somewhere else and they can come and poop in your front garden they can come and poop in your life so they can bring all their rubbish and all their mess and and pile it on you and sometimes they can do it many times and it can be annoying sometimes you clean the mess and sometimes you don't know what to do sometimes you talk to them because humans can hear and you tell them look I don't want your mess in my life and if they hear fine if they don't hear then you have a burden to be clearing that poop and one of the ways to do that is to be forgiving and forgiving and forgiving and that's the way I've lived with the cats because I've realized the cats may not change, but I've tried by every means possible to keep the cats off. So in as much as we are forgiving, we need to find strategies of avoiding other people's messes, avoiding other people's rubbish, avoiding other people's poo in our life. So today, my encouragement to you, don't be so mad about that person who brings all the rubbish their rubbish to your life but rather be forgiving to them if you can't help them to show them the right way if they don't listen continue to be forgiving but find every means possible to help them not to bring shit in your life not to poop in your life not to bring rubbish in your life yes you need to be forgiving very forgiving very patient and also able to teach them to learn that they can handle their poo by placing it in the right place and life will be much better, much smoother. Have a wonderful day. Hopefully I didn't miss your day. I just wanted to say some lesson I've learned from the cat. I've just cleared the poo. So I have a good day and I've also put something there to deter the cats from pooping there. And I've forgiven those people who could have brought messes in my life. And I'm moving on and I'm trying to help other people not to mess their life. God bless you.